Well, it is time now for another Country Girl Report. Today we are talking about some unique ways to use puzzles. And Catherine Nigren of Fountain Flora is back with more. Nice to have Catherine back today from Wahoo. Thanks for making the drive. Yeah, not a problem. And we're talking about puzzles today. We're starting to see more of them around and um, they're beautiful to look at, to display, mm -hmm. and also fun to put together. So talk about how you're seeing more puzzles in your store. Yeah, absolutely. I think as the world gets more digital, it's kind of fun to unplug and do something with your hands that's not behind a screen. Mm -hmm. um, so one of the things that we thought was really fun is these puzzles that come like in a little bag, okay. in a little zipper bag. Oh. So you can pass them around to friends. Mm -hmm. And they've got lines on the bag where you can sign the puzzle and pass it along. So it's kind of that human connection that's not behind a screen. Yeah. You know? Fun. Well, I know my son has kind of gotten into chess. Yes. And that's another thing, you know, just kind of getting back to the basics of doing Legos, using your hands, mm -hmm. you know, using your mind. Mm -hmm. um, so this is good for traveling. Yeah, traveling. It's okay. good for like friend groups, you know, book groups, nursing homes. I think it'd be fun to kind of, you know, just share around with all kinds of friends okay. of all ages. Let's talk about some more puzzle pieces. And a lot of these are durable. They're made out of uh, wood, some of them, right? Yeah, yeah. This this company makes them out of wood, so they can stand up to being used and passed around in bags. Mm -hmm. They also make this one in a jar, um, kind of as a, what do you do with a puzzle? How do you display it besides putting it in a box in your closet? And mm -hmm. so this would be kind of a pretty way to put it on a shelf, and then when you want to bring it down and do it, come down, put your puzzle together, and then it's it doubles as decor and not just um, space taken up in your in your storage. Mm -hmm. And a lot of these are graphic images, aren't they? Like either flowers. Yeah, yeah, we love puzzles that have like either plants or flowers on them, obviously. Mm -hmm. um, so we kind of lean towards those, but there's so many really pretty more art puzzles now on the market than you ever seen before. Okay, what's this one? So that is actually a library kit. I pulled that out of our book nook because it's made for like sharing books, kind of like the old fashioned library, oh. you know, where you'd stamp the card and like loan out your books. Mm -hmm. And we thought, wouldn't it be fun to loan out your puzzles? Like if you have a puzzle collection, another way to share it with your friends and kind of have that human interaction um, would be to check them out like an old book. And it's kind of like that nostalgic, you know, piece too that we think is really fun. Oh, it is cute. Okay. And then another puzzle idea up here. Yeah, there's different ones. Um, mm -hmm. Some of those are diamond shape and they're round. Um, they're really pretty. And so if you do want to like frame them or seal them after you're done, it's kind of like adding a piece of art to your home. Okay, perfect, great. So if people want to come in and check out these puzzles, yeah. um, when are you open, Catherine? Sure, we're open uh, Monday through Saturday. Uh, Monday through Friday is 9 to 5, and Saturday is 9 to 1. Okay, perfect. We forgot this little guy. Oh, yeah, our friend Linda actually has one of these, and she has it on her coffee table, and she said when people come over, she just finds them, like, playing them. It's like it's really soothing. They just kind of, you know, tactile play with the puzzle. Uh-huh. Is it, I wonder if this one's hard to put together. You just gotta move it, you have to move it around yep. or can you take them off? You can take them off, yeah. Okay. And it's actually double sided, <laughs> so it's two different puzzles in one. So after you do this one, you can flip them all over and then it's double sided to do another puzzle. Oh, really? Very, yeah. very cool. Okay, so many puzzle ideas here. Catherine, thanks for coming in today. Yeah, not a problem. Okay, back.